You no longer have to choose between having money or taking care of your gut health. Here are the best probiotics under $20. If you're anything like me, this is probably your 100th video looking at what probiotics you should try, what products you should take. You've probably added some to your cart, but because they cost, you know, like $50, $60, you get them into your cart and you like reconsider everything that you ever thought about them. You know, like where else can you use that money? Are the probiotics actually worth it? What's gonna happen? You may even get further than that and like go through to the next page of the checkout, but when it says confirm or complete purchase, Purchase, you back out. And that's what I do all the time. So let me help you with this struggle right now. All the probiotics that I'm about to list are going to be under the $20 and they're going to pass our quality control test. What goes into this quality control test is really pretty simple. There's like two main factors that I look for when I look for quality probiotics, and that's going to be the amount of, of probiotics that are in there. That's going to, you're going to want above 1 billion. You're going to try to shoot for like at least 5 billion, right? But 1 billion is the bare minimum. 1 billion CFU, that's colony forming units. That means how many bacteria can essentially uh, grow and populate your gut. And the second thing that you're going to want to look for is you want one of the three main probiotic strains. I might be confusing you with all these numbers, but you want one of the three main probiotic strains. It's going to be lactobacillus, uh, lactobacillus bifidobacterium, and Saccharomyces. Saccharomyces. Sac I always have trouble with this one. Saccharomyces. If your favorite probiotic is not on list, don't worry. You know, if it's working well for you, don't just throw them away, continue to use them. The only reason they're not on this list is because they probably don't pass our quality control tests. They probably don't have 1 billion plus CFU. They probably don't have one of the three top strengths. So a study by the World Health Organization found that probiotics can reduce diarrhea by up to 42%. And a different study by the Journal of Clinical Gastroenterology found taking probiotics reduces the risk of developing IBD, inflammatory bowel disease, by 30%. I know on my personal journey, finding a quality probiotics is what took me from good gut health to great gut health. But I know many of you may not have ulcerative colitis or you may have a different form of something that you're looking for. So like it's good for me that I found the probiotic for me, but like what is gonna help you? There are some other signs that you need probiotics in addition to IBD, IBS, or unhealthy stool habits, people that lack mental clarity, people that have recently used antibiotics, you wanna repopulate your gut with some good bacteria. If you have very high sugar or carbohydrate cravings, it's probably a good, a good sign that your, your microbiome is out of whack a little bit. You probably wanna adjust that with food probiotics first, but if you're looking for supplements, this is gonna work for you as well. And people that have developed skin problems, this eczema, psoriasis, rashes, the microbiome is on our skin as well as in our gut. It's kind of this complete full system. So it's gonna help you all as well. More people are suffering from GI related issues now more than ever. Global probiotics market is expected to reach 64 billion by 2023. So it's no wonder why a lot of people are searching for probiotics. It's probably no wonder why you found this video and are looking to improve your gut health. You're not alone. We have our best probiotics under $20 coming up right now. now all of these are going to be available on, on Amazon. So I'll provide links to all these. I'll provide Amazon links to all these. You can check out their rating. You can check out, you know, you can go order it, purchase it. It'll be in the description below. First on the list is going to be Florigen Digestive Probiotic. This was on my other article about probiotics and for a good reason. Um, so Florigen is going to come in at 1869 on Amazon. Florigen is attractive because of three probiotic blend and the fact that it needs to be refrigerated. Not to mention they have special formulas for women and children. I'm a fan of probiotics that need to be refrigerated because of what I know about bacteria and the longevity and the potency and the, I'm searching for the word, viability. The viability of bacteria, meaning how well can they survive the journey to the gut? How much of a chance do they have when they're in the gut to repopulate? So right, like bacteria, if they had a superpower, it would be to like split and multiply really fast and, and rapidly. And that's what viability indicates, like how well or how easy can they replicate? Um, I'm not saying that probiotics not in the refrigerator cannot replicate and do that. Um, just when I had my job in the lab, right? We refrigerated every, every probiotic that, or excuse me, every bacteria that we worked with. So it just makes sense to me that any of the, the brands that require refrigeration that come in like a little ice pack with the indicator on whether they're too hot or not, that those are going to be the better, better probiotics. And that's why this is number one on the list. And the beautiful thing is that 
sure it requires uh refrigeration but a lot of these can last for two weeks two weeks plus outside of the fridge and still remain uh, potent still remain viable so that's why I, why I, this one's number one and then again the second thing that i that i enjoy about florigen is that they have special formulas for again, women children um other let's see here right kids oh and they have one for I believe this one in here is for either, I think antibiotics. So once you've taken antibiotics, you want to take this special one. Oh, eczema one, like anyone that has specialized, it could be marketing. Um, I actually should have looked into that maybe before I, I'm over here talking about it, but I would assume that they have certain type of bacteria in there that help with whether that's eczema or whether that's uh, pH health for women, kids, maybe kids need different, not maybe they need different bacterial strains than adults, right? So that's why again, I'm a fan of Florigen. It's $18, like go try it. Um, so they have the, the unique three strand blend of lactobacillus, uh, acidophilus, lactobacillus, and bifidobacterium. So two lactobacillus and a bifidobacterium. They have two of the three, mo you know, most recommended strains. Has the ability to improve intestinal health, regulate digestive and vaginal environments, ease GI infections, diarrhea, stimulate immune response, prevent certain allergies. So that's why I love them. I love this brand a lot. Although you know, I use a different one. So it has again three strains, three unique strains in it. And it comes with 15 billion live capsules. Um, so it, it goes above our, our, what is it? 1 billion recommended CFU. So a con might be that you need to refrigerate, but again, I already explained, you can leave it out of the fridge for two weeks. If you're a traveler, if you, whatever, don't have the fridge space, which look at the size of this thing. That doesn't make any sense. But if I had to give Florigen an emoji, I might give it the smiling face with the star eyes. Second on the list, now that we've already done Florigen, I'm gonna just go through the list and um, go based off of Amazon ratings. So the most reviewed probiotics with the highest rating. So that's the way that this order is going. So the second is going to be Physician's Choice Probiotic with 60 billion CFU. We're on their website here. You can see the 60 billion CFU, 10 proven strains, supports overall gut health. It says $25.95 right here, which is not under $20. But if you go to Amazon, it is under $20. It is $19.77 for your purchase. So um, don't worry about it. I'm still keeping my word. It's got Physician's Choice has a 10 probiotic strain formulated with 10 unique strains of world-class probiotics to help colonize the gut with good bacteria and improve the digestive system. It's also got a unique organic pre prebiotic fiber blend, which uh, contains organic chicory root, contains some acai Senegal, whatever that is, I don't really know. It also has some organic Jerusalem artichoke root and organic, oh, I already said chicory root. Did I say that? I don't know. Okay. but. Also, you see they have 125,000 reviews on Amazon, which is excellent, and 4.5 out of five stars. So one thing that I do enjoy for any product reviews, especially these kind, is going to the three-star one. So you see, you click the three-star, you kind of get the truth, right? You get the middle of um, not super bullish, not super bearish, not super loved it, not super hated it, but that seems to be, right? So new allergic reaction, so maybe they got, uh, you see, you could read here, change in ingredients. So apparently there was a change in something. Oh, this year, I forgot I had it right here. They're okay. Again, that was from last year, didn't work, worked well. So of course, if you go to the five stars, they're gonna be 75, 3% of people loved it. And then this 27% uh, of people didn't like it. Um, so that's number two on the list. Oops, sorry. I love that it has the 60 billion CFU. I love that it has 10 proven strains. So it's got a high CFU, a lot of strains. The cons is that there's a bit extra on the ingredient list that I'm not sure um, needs to be there. And that could be what these people are talking about as far as new allergic reaction. Like why does there need to be rice flour? Um, I don't know, I'm not obviously the creator. So why does it need to be rice flour, gum Arabic, sunflower oil? We know that seed oils are not good. Why is there sunflower oil in here? And now I'm rethinking, like, what number should this be? So that's what it is. I might give this one a thumbs up um, emoji, but maybe with also a 
hmm face. So as we continue to move down this list, research suggests that probiotics can help improve mental health from a study in the Journal of Clinical Psychology, finding that probiotics improve symptoms of depression and anxiety in patients with mass with major depressive disorder. Okay, we're not doing bad. So the third on the list is going to be New Rhythm Probiotics for $16.99 on Amazon. New Rhythm Probiotics is going to give you powerful support for healthy digestive and balance your intestinal ecology. Probiotics brand trusted and purchased by tens of thousands of people. Can you hear my puppy down there? <laughs> you can see here on Amazon that there's 30,000 ratings, almost 31, and it's got 4.6 out of five stars, a little bit better, but similar metrics, right? 74% of people loved it. The other percent of people didn't um, like it so much. One of the unique things about New Rhythm Probiotics is that it contains a premium food-based prebiotic fiber designed to aid in the maintenance of probiotic activity in the intestine. We know that prebiotics feed probiotics in our gut. So moving down the list, we have the BioSchwartz Probiotic 40 Billion CFU at 1879 on Amazon. It's got 20,000 ratings and it has 4.5 out of five stars. You see all of these kind of similar, 74% people are happy with it. That's why I like to click on the three stars, just to get a little bit of the full, more full picture perhaps. We're gonna navigate over to their website. Oh, look at that, little black hand, cool. <laughs> okay, uh, so cool. It benefits, promotes digestive health, obviously immune support, helps relieve gas, bloating and discomfort. One of the things, the reason this one made the list not one of not the only reason but i enjoy their um they have a turmeric curcumin supplement that i enjoy uh, by bio Schwartz, so i thought it was appropriate to also put their probiotic on here even though i haven't tried it but it's patent delayed release probiotic formula with 40 billion cfu so it meets our minimum threshold of 1 billion is exclusive uh, formula to protect against stomach acid delivery system so it can survive that trip from the mouth through to the gut. The benefit is that it supports digestive health, immune support, stomach health, energy management, weight management, all this stuff that they claim on their website. And then it has, so 40 billion CFU, and it has one, two, three, four different types of probiotic strains of which you have your lactobacillus and bifidobacterium. So it may not have as many strains as the other brand, brands that we've been over but still you know under twenty dollars and it meets those two minimum criteria. if i had to give it an emoji i might give it a smiley face with like the top teeth showing but maybe not both teeth showing you feel me like so moving on we have our garden of life doctor formulated once daily three-in-one complete probiotics the one i have here is i don't know how i ordered the wrong one this one is not under twenty dollars but if you see on the screen uh this one here the probiotics with 30 billion pre uh pro post is under $30, uh, twenty dollars. It's sixteen seventy nine. It's got a hundred much less ratings. Um, I like this brand for other supplements that they have. Garden of Life. Actually, they were okay. They weren't like the greatest, but they're, again, they're everywhere. So, you, so you shouldn't have a problem finding it. I do like that. It's got a ton of strains. It's got here. So it's got thirty billion CFU and sixteen probiotic strains clinically studied. So I love that. Right. It's got some lactobacillus it's got some bifidobacterium has some other strains that i hadn't heard of so i like that that part about them maybe they're not the most well you know they don't have the most ratings but they have the 4.4 five out of five stars with the same, same profile 74 percent you see here the prebiotics or we already know what those are they feed the probiotics probiotics postbiotics make up probiotics more powerful um, you see here 50 milligrams of cycle postbiotics. It's a fermentation process that happens within the probiotics to help them function better, essentially. So it helps support bifidobacteria growth. Moving on, the next one that I have here is a line. Now, uh, this one maybe also didn't actually make the list initially, but it's in like CVS, it's in like all these stores, and it's so well, I would say, marketed that I chose it. To, to include in here. And of course it's under the $20 threshold you see on Amazon here. It's got significantly less reviews, right? 1850, it's got 4.6 out of five stars, so similar. Um, so Align, Align Probiotic is the number one probiotic recommended by GI over 14 years. Now this is a statement made by Align. So like, mm, I don't know about that, but <laughs> you know, um, Align Gut Health supports immune health and contains bifidobacterium, 
Lactis BB12, which naturally helps promote healthy immune function. And it's got five billion of these uh, of this bifidobacterium. So, the like it's got one strain, and it has like it reaches the threshold of it's pretty good in terms of strain number, but it also markets that it has a unique strain. And whenever I searched, there were other probiotics with this same strain. So, um, I put it on there again because if you're in the store and you see it and you're really searching for something it's not a bad option but also it's like you know middle of the road in my opinion better than nothing if i was to give it an emoji i'd give it a smiley face with no teeth showing so comment below let me know which one of those do you think you might get which one of those have you maybe you tried and you're like hey those don't work just let me know because because you know we're working together here there's no way i could try all of them so let me know what you think about it if you like this you're getting value from it go ahead and like and subscribe and if you enjoyed this video and you're looking to go maybe a little bit more in depth or you want to understand more about choosing the pro right probiotic for you and check out our video choosing the best for you and your gut health there's a tons of great stuff in that video for example like how do we know if the probiotic we choose are working you know it, which I'm sure you have the question of, okay, if I decide to buy this $20 probiotic, what am I going to even see? How do I know that it's working? We're going to start with one good indicator to tell if your probiotic is working is going to be improved stool health. Maybe you had gas or bloating or, or diarrhea or constipation. Your probiotic should improve these symptoms. Hopefully you're going to have some clearer skin because the microbiome is found on the skin as well as in the gut. You're going to have improved energy, a clearness of mind, and you'll have less cravings for worse food and crave better foods because the probiotic the good probiotics in your good belly are going to tell you to like hey give us some more of that and maybe avoid this and if you made it all the way to the end of this video i highly suggest you check out our video choosing the right probiotic for you for a more in-depth review so i'll see you there